This is MSA 2021, 6th August shift to 2 position. The ratio in which the point capital B that is 33 by 5 comma 28 by 5 comma 38 by 5 divides the line segment joining capital A 3 to 4 and capital C 9 comma 8 comma 10. Here is line segment is given that is line segment AC is given this is the line segment AC A point is 3 to 4 and C point is 9 comma 8 comma 10 this A point is taken as X1 Y1 Z1 and B point is taken as X2 Y2 Z2 the point B divides the line segment in the ratio now we find this that is B point is 33 by 5 28 by 5 38 by 5 the point B divides in the ratio the B point is taken as this is X comma this point is taken as X comma Y comma Z this is the point B now ratio is equal to this is the formula ratio is equal to x1 minus x is to x minus x2 here x1 value is 3 minus x that is 33 by 5 is to 33 by 5 minus x2 this is 9 this is 3 minus 35 by 3 take LCM that is 15 minus 33 by 5 is to 33 minus 9 that is 33 minus 45 by 5 here 5 5 cancelled so 15 minus 33 this is minus 18 is to 33 minus 45 this is minus 12 here minus minus cancelled and here 6 3 times cancelled 2 times cancelled that is equal to 3 is to 2 Therefore, the point B divides in the ratio that is equal to 3 is to 2. That is the required answer. This is MSA 2021, 6th August 61 question. This is capital A, 2 comma 3 comma minus 4 and capital B, minus 3 comma 3 comma minus 2 and capital C minus 1 comma 4 comma 2 and capital D 3 comma 5 comma 1 are the vortex of a tetrahedron if G1 comma G2 comma G3 are the centroids of the three faces having the vortex D in common then the centroid of triangle G1 G2 G3 is dash here G1 is given. G1 is centroid of triangle ABD. Here the point D is common. And G2 is given. This is centroid G of. This is also centroid G of AC, ACD. Here one point D is common. And G3 is given. This is centroid G of BCD. The point BD is common. That is now we find G1. G1 is centroid G of ABD. So that is centroid is 2 minus 3 plus 3 ABD. We know that X1 plus X2 plus X3 by 3, comma Y1 plus Y2 plus Y3 by that is 3 plus 3 plus 5 by 3. And Z coordinates minus 4 minus 2 plus 1 by 3. So that is equal to here 3, 3 cancel. That is equal to 2 by 3, 5 plus 6. This is 11 by 3. This is minus 5 by 3. And G2. G2 is the centroid of ACD. Now we find the ACD centroid. That is 2 minus 1 plus 3 by 3. Next one, 3 plus 4 plus 5 by 3. Minus 4 plus 2 plus 1 by 3. That is equal to 3 plus 2, 5 minus 1. This is 4 by 3. 5 plus 4, 9 plus 3. This is 12 by 3. Minus 4 plus 3. This is minus 1 by 3. 
and G3. G3 is the centroid of BCD. That is BCD is minus 3 minus 1 plus 3 by 3. So this is 3 plus 4 plus 5 by 3 and minus 2 plus 2 plus 1 by 3. So that is equal to here 3, 3 cancel. This is minus 1 by 3, 12 by 3. Here 2, 2 cancel. That is equal to 1 by 3. So now we find the centroid of the triangle G1, G2, G3. Therefore, centroid is G, capital G is equal to. This is centroid of G1, G2, G3. That is 2 by 3 plus 4 by 3 minus 1 by 3 whole by 3 and 11 by 3 plus 12 by 3 plus 12 by 3 whole by 3 minus 5 by 3 minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 whole by 3 here 1 by 3 1 by 3 cancel that is equal to 2 plus 4 6 6 minus 1 5 by 3 by 3 this is 5 by 9 11 by 3 plus 12 by 3 plus 12 by 3 24 plus 11 this is 35 by 3 whole by 3 this is 35 by 9 this is minus 5 by 3 by 3 this is minus 5 by 9 this is the centroid of the triangle g1 comma g2 comma g3 This is M C twenty twenty one fifth August shift to two question. The centroid of a triangle with vertex capital A three four five and capital B six comma seven comma two and capital C x comma y comma z is three two three. Then x plus y plus z is equal to dash. Here is given G G is given that is G is equal to centroid. This is centroid of A, B, C. We know that centroid formula that is x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3, y1 plus y2 plus y3 by 3, z1 plus z2 plus z3 by 3. Here G is given that is centroid G is 3, 2, 3. That is equal to x1. This is 3 plus 6 plus x by 3 and 4 plus 7 plus y by 3 5 plus 2 plus z by 3 from this 3 is equal to 3 plus 6 9 plus x by 3 equating x coordinates this is 9 is equal to 9 plus x 9 9 cancel x value is 0 and equating y coordinates that is 2 is equal to 7 plus 4 11 plus y by 3 that is 6 is equal to 11 plus y so from this y is equal to 6 minus 11 this is minus 5 and equating z coordinates that is 3 is equal to 5 plus 2 7 plus z by 3 that is 3 into 3, 9 is equal to 7 plus z from this z is equal to 9 minus 7 is 2 now we find the value of x plus y plus z that x value is 0 y value minus 5 and z value plus 2 that is equal to minus 5 plus 2 minus 3 this is the value of x plus y plus z The four points capital A that is 2 comma minus 1 comma 3 capital B 4 minus 2 1 and capital C 4 5 minus 7 and capital D 2 6 minus 5 forms A first option square second one parallelogram third one rectangle fourth one square this is M side 2021 5th August 6 to 1 question Square means all sides are equal. That means AB is equal to BC is equal to CD is equal to DA. 
AD and diagonals AC and BD is also equal. This is the condition for square. And parallelogram means opposite sides equal. That is AB is equal to CD and BC is equal to AD and diagonals AC not equal to BD. And rectangle, rectangle means opposite sides equal. That is AB is equal to CD, BC is equal to AD and diagonals equal. That is AC is equal to BD. This is square. Fourth one is rhombus. This is rhombus. Rhombus means all sides equal. AB is equal to BC is equal to CD is equal to DA. And diagonals AC is not equal to BD. These are the conditions for square and parallelogram and rectangle and rhombus. In all these quadrilaters, diagonals bisects each other. Diagonals bisects each other. That is, midpoints of the diagonals are equal. First, we find the distances. That is, we know that the distance between two points that is under root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square plus z2 minus z1 whole square. This is the formula for distance between two points p x1 y1 z1 and q x2 y2 z2. First we find a b distance that is a b is equal to under root of 4 minus 2 whole square minus 2 plus 1 whole square and 1 minus 3 whole square. So that is equal to 4 minus 2 whole square is 4 minus 2 plus 1 whole square 1 1 minus 3 whole square that is equal to root 9 is equal to 3. And find the distance BC. BC is equal to under root of 4 minus 4 whole square 5 plus 2 whole square and minus 7 minus 1 whole square that is equal to 4 minus 4 0 5 plus 2 all square 49 minus 7 minus 1 this is 64 that is equal to root over 113 and find the distance cd cd means under root of 2 minus 4 all square plus 6 minus 5 all square minus 5 plus 7 all square that is equal to under root of 2 minus 4 whole square 4 6 minus 5 1 that is minus 5 plus 7 2 square is 4 that is equal to root 9 is equal to 3 and find the distance ad ad means under root of ad that is 2 minus 2 whole square plus 6 plus 1 whole square plus minus 5 minus 3 whole square so that is equal to 2 minus 2 whole square 0, 6 plus 1, 7 square 49, minus 5 minus 3, minus 8 whole square that is 64, that is equal to under root of 60, 40, 1, this is 1, 1, 3. Observe this opposite sides are equal, that is AB is equal to CD and BC is equal to AD. That means the quadrilateral must be a parallelogram or rectangle. This rhombus is wrong and square is also wrong. Now we find diagonals. That is diagonals are AC. That is AC is equal to. So under root of AC that is 4 minus 2 whole square. That is 5 plus 1 whole square and minus 7 minus 3 whole square so that is equal to 4 minus 2 whole square 4 5 plus 1 whole square 36 minus 7 minus 3 this is 100 that is equal to root over 140 now find the next diagonal bd bd is equal to under root of that is 2 minus 4 whole square that is 6 plus 2 whole square plus minus 5 minus 1 whole square that is equal to under root of 2 minus 4 whole square 4 6 plus 2 8 square that is 64 minus 5 minus this is 36 that is equal to under root of 64 plus 36 100 plus 4 104 here diagonals not equal ac is not equal to bd that means the given points form a parallelogram this is the answer
if 9 by 4 comma 5 by 4 comma 15 by 4 is the centroid of a tetrahedron whose vertex are capital A A21 and capital B 1 comma B comma 4 and capital C 4 comma 0 comma C and capital D 1 comma 1 comma 7 then dash find the relation between A B C this is M set 2021 4th August shift 1 question we know that the centroid of the tetrahedron G is equal to that is x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 by 4 y1 plus y2 plus y3 plus y4 by 4 z1 plus z2 plus z3 plus z4 by 4 now centroid G is given in the problem that is 9 by 4 this is 5 by 4 this is 15 by 4 that is equal to x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 by 4 that is a plus 1 plus 4 plus 1 by 4 and y coordinates this is 2 plus b plus 0 plus 1 by 4 and z coordinates 1 plus 4 plus c plus 7 by 4 equating x coordinates that is 9 by 4 is equal to a plus 1 plus 4 plus 1 this is a plus 6 by 4 4 4 cancel from this a is equal to 9 minus 6 a is equal to 3 and equating y coordinates that is 5 by 4 is equal to this is b plus 3 by 4 4 4 cancel so from this b is equal to 5 minus 3 b is equal to 2 and equating z coordinates that is 15 by 4 is equal to this is c plus 12 by 4 4 4 cancel c is equal to 15 minus 12 that is equal to 3 now find the relation between these two here b value is 2 add 1 on both sides that is b plus 1 is equal to 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 that is a is equal to 3 and b plus 1 is equal to 3 and c is equal to 3 that means a is equal to b plus 1 is equal to c this is the relation between a comma b comma c